So I'm sure we've all uh, had this issue before where you extract a uh, mobile game, this is typically where you find these files, and you get this data.unity3d. Now, you see that and you think, and you think, oh, Unity3d, you know, it should be able to open my uh, Unity extract extracting tool. But then uh, you find out pretty pretty quickly uh, that's not that's not how it works whatsoever. <laughs> so how do how do we fix this? Well, this is how you fix data dot uh, Unity 3D files. What you want to do is uh, go into the link in the description because that will bring you to this tool once Firefox loads. It'll bring you to this tool, UABEA. And download it for Windows, because let's be for real, you're using Windows. If you are using Linux, then get that one. And if it don't work properly, install these too. But uh, I don't need to install these. I already have pretty much every single one of these installed. So uh, now go to where you've downloaded it. I've already, I already have it downloaded here. And now uh, open it. Well, extract it. And once, once you've extracted it, uh, if you can find the exe file, open it. Pause recording real fast. Okay, it loaded. So now you want to go to File and click on Open because I don't think you can just drag and drop it. Now go to where that uh, data dot that data dot Unity 3D is and open it, and it should come up with a little pop up that's like this bundle is compressed, uh, decompressed to file or memory, decompress it to to file or memory just, just click memory <laughs> and you should see oh this is something I'm a lot more familiar with you know asset files and these level files now what you want to do is click uh, export all and export it to where you want to put it so I'm just gonna put it here and uh, wait uh, I'll this it depends on how many files there are. This is a pretty newer uh, iPhone game, so it's going to take a little bit because there's a lot of files in it. So I'll, I'll pause the recording again so you don't have to wait. Oh, never mind. It's done. And now, once you go check that uh, folder, you should see all these. And now, all you have to do is do what you would do. You know, drag and drop the assets in. And it should work. As you can see, you now have it. And you can click any of these and see your assets. So yeah, that's uh, how you extract uh, Unity 3D files. Um, I don't know if it works with every Unity 3D file, because usually this can open them. Or at least people said it usually can. But... You know, if you're just struggling with certain Unity 3D files, there you go. This is your tutorial. This is your fix for that uh, that error.